Welcome to Lecture 3 on the Risk Management Framework, RMF, and the Federal Information Security Management Act, FISMA. In this lecture, we will explore the key concepts and principles related to RMF and FISMA, which are essential for managing risks and ensuring the security of federal information systems. We will discuss the six steps of the RMF process, the significance of FISMA compliance, the organizational structures in cybersecurity, system classifications, the CIA principles of federal system security, and the TRI framework of risk management. By the end of this lecture, you will have a solid understanding of these foundational aspects of risk management in the federal context. Let's dive in. FISMA mandates risk management for federal agencies, and RMF provides a structured approach to managing risks. The framework consists of six steps. Categorize, select, implement, assess, authorize, and monitor. RMF ensures the security of federal information systems, and compliance with RMF is essential for FISMA compliance. FISMA is a law that governs information security for federal agencies. It requires agencies to develop and implement security programs to ensure the confidentiality, integrity, and availability of information. Compliance with FISMA is necessary for the smooth operation of federal agencies, and it provides a framework for protecting federal information systems. Cybersecurity organizations within federal agencies can vary. Common roles include the Chief Information Security Officer, CISO, along with security analysts, incident responders, and risk assessors. Organizational structures may differ based on agency size and mission, but collaboration between cybersecurity teams is crucial for effective defense against cyber threats. General Support System, GSS, refers to the infrastructure that supports an agency's mission. Major Applications, MA, are critical applications that support agency operations, while Minor Applications, MA, have limited impact and are non-critical. Inherent systems are built-in security features within hardware or software. Understanding these classifications helps prioritize security controls and risk management efforts. The CIA principles form the foundation of security in federal information systems. Confidentiality involves protecting sensitive information from unauthorized access. Integrity ensures data accuracy and prevents unauthorized modifications. Availability ensures timely access to information and system resources. These principles guide security measures to safeguard federal systems and data. The TRI framework of risk management consists of three steps, assess, respond, and monitor. Assess involves identifying and evaluating risks to the organization. Respond focuses on developing and implementing risk mitigation strategies. Monitor involves continuously assessing and monitoring the effectiveness of controls. This framework enables proactive risk management and ensures ongoing protection of federal information systems. The Risk Management Framework, RMF, and FISMA are crucial for federal agencies to effectively manage risks and ensure the security of information systems. Cybersecurity organizational charts may vary but collaboration is essential for success. Understanding system classifications helps prioritize security controls, and the CIA principles guide federal system security measures. The TRI framework of risk management enables proactive risk mitigation and ensures the continuous protection of federal information systems.